Welcome back to Natural Vitamins Bigger Than Big Show. We're here at the MPC Steve Stone Metropolitan Championship. And we're here in Teaneck, New Jersey, which is a new venue. Bigger spot for the athletes and a more, more space for the fans. I have two amazing guests with me. I have Fabian Orozco from Team MHP. I am PB Pro, Jeff Beckham, classic. Um, let me get started with Fabian. Fabian, tell me what's going on, man. I know you're a busy guy. You're you're Mr. 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 Worldwide. Forget Pitbull. You're Mr. Worldwide. Yeah. All right. <laughs> tell me a little about what's going on with you and all the projects you're working on. Well, I'm just uh, at a representation of my brand, MHP Muscle Meds. A great leader, Gerard Dentist, Steve Downs, and the phenomenal team of the IABB and the MPC are we in the United States. As you know, I'm one of the first Latinos to be able to do this worldwide. And actually, I've taken it into my heart, into my my hands to represent the Latino community. Uh, also, you know, all these beautiful people here from the United States that gave me the opportunity uh, to go out and do this. And, you know, we're excited about touching every country and to teach them uh, about everything that we've been doing in the past few years. It's a new generation. And only through education uh, is the key, you know, for these people to understand and to follow everything that we're doing. So I'm very excited. I definitely agree with you. The new generation is actually learning from people like you that know the craft. I would say you're a master at this craft because you've been doing veteran at this. When it comes to prepping, when it comes to dieting, when it comes to posing, when it does to everything that comes with sport, you're the man to see. Now, I know you also do all these services, correct? Yes. Where can they reach you in terms of phone number and email or that type of thing? Yeah, well, the, for, first of all, you know, thank you so much for those kind words, you know. Uh, everything that I do is for my people, for you. And, you know, God has given me wisdom, but it's only to develop it and send a message to you so you could actually capture it and take it into your families, your friends, and next generation. Um, I have worked with hundreds of, of athletes. As you can see, I have FabianNutrition.com, also MHPStrong.com, MHP Transformations. And I have worked, you know, with professional bodybuilders, uh, women uh, physique, women uh, uh, figure, bikini, uh, bodybuilders and also people from scratch, people from the beginning. Yeah, people that haven't been in the sport. Yeah. Not just you started, they wanted to do this, the right person to see you. So you started them off. Yeah, this is a that's lifestyle. A, a lifestyle. You know, it's a that's lifestyle, sure. you know? So, and actually we have the key. You yes. know, everything about what we do is about nutrition, supplementation, training, and resting. And not just nutrition of the physical appearance, but nutrition of the mind and the spirit. You know, and actually to put all these things together, and everything to work and have a longevity, a good long life. Absolutely, absolutely. Like you said, it's a lifetime. You're watching the Bigger Than Big Show. I'm your host, Ren Star. I'm here with Fabian Orozco from MHP. Also, you've been doing a lot of traveling. I know you were in Peru just very recently, right? Correct? Yes, sir. I mean, just tell us about all your ventures, all the traveling you've been doing at, to just spread the word of our, the sport that we love so dearly. So what countries have you been at? Well, Guys, you know, thanks to my, again, to my beautiful man, Gerard Dentist, Steve Downs, and, and a great also leader to me, uh, Angela Moraz. You know, they gave me the opportunity to start traveling and actually took it, you know, very seriously, you know, and to learn it so much throughout the years, you know, to be able to travel like to Colombia, Brazil, Paraguay, uh, Germany, Holland, uh, Spain, you know, I'm the Arnold uh, host. I know you, know, you are, the, you know, the MC, absolutely. And, yes, <laughs> and, uh, you know, in Mexico. And now, this year, you know, we have a tremendous amount of, uh, of countries that we need, that we are going to visit, including Australia and South Africa. Uh, oh, wow. Which they just included in my and in, in my in my journeys. Um, so I'm excited. You know, I just came back from Peru. The beautiful people down there. You know, Sandra Pumar and her team. You know, Nutri, uh, uh, the Sanac team. They they received those uh, uh, Kai Green and me. You know, in such a beautiful way. As you can see, we had over 5,000 fans that came in. My seminars were very. Uh, Exception. We, we went to, to the point with that. Yeah, and I want to mention something. When you were in Peru, you had a birthday in Peru, correct? Yeah. When you were during the seminar, what happened? What did they do for you? <laughs> well, I, I was teaching the, the seminar, and all of a sudden they came from the back and with a cake. Oh, that's and, great. Uh, and the whole audience got up and they sang happy birthday to me. It was, a, it was an amazing moment, and I thank my God for all these gifts. Nothing to him, everything to him, and nothing to me. 
and it was a big experience. You know that you have such a hold, or, or they hold you dearly. North America, we need people like you in this sport. And thank it's, a, you. it's an honor to have you on our program here. Thank you so, so much. Orozco, thank you so very much. Thank you, my All friend. right. He'll be at also, you'll be at FIBO, correct? Yes, I'm leaving Tuesday to FIBO. Tuesday to FIBO, so look out for him there in MHP as well. We're here at the MPC 2015 Thiefstone Metropolitan Championships here in Teaneck, New Jersey. Thank you so very much, baby. I appreciate that. Thank You're you, the my man. friend. Thank, thank you so very much. Hey, guys, we have a special guest here with us. We have IFBB Pro Jeff, the Beckham. Just classic, right? Just classic. I love it. Jeff, what's going on, brother? Tell me what you've been up to. Good, I'm good. I've just been relaxing, man. You know, the live show that I did was the Tampa Pro last year in August. So I just, I actually took two months off after the Tampa Pro, and I've just been taking it easy, putting a lot of things offside, off the stage, and playing into perspective. You know? Perfection. I know that when it comes to a sport, you are one of the hard workers of this sport. Not only that, but when it comes outside of bodybuilding, you're an entrepreneur. Yes, sir. So you're a businessman, which I like to see. A thank lot you. of guys so diversify much. themselves. So I love so to see that. Um, thank you so as much. myself, being an entrepreneur, I look at people like you because you know what? Being a young man, we have to try to see what we can do in our lives. Absolutely. Don't say, you know, just you know, pigeonhole yourself to one little Absolutely. thing. Absolutely. And it's Absolutely. good to diversify. Absolutely. Um, Absolutely. That aspect. Tell us what you're doing in terms of businesses. What other things you are out there? Maybe people are, in terms of supplements. Are, are you doing? I know you had the Be Beckham cookie for a while yeah, there. Yeah, and you yeah, still yeah, have yeah. it out there. What's going on? Yeah, so what's going on with me is I actually um, began teaching at Manhattan Institute. I'm actually the national certification teacher there. I've been doing that for six months. That's been going really well. Very um, I'm good. I'm pleased to say. I've also actually, I'm getting into singing as well. I know you guys always know that, you know, I like to sing. You so do. I'm actually just now starting to get vocal lessons as well. And I'm going to try to see what I can do with that because I definitely believe um, in body, bodybuilding is cool. I love the sport and everything, but you definitely have to make sure that you're able to do, you know, multiple things offside the stage, off the stage too with just branding yourself, you know? And I think a lot of people alongside myself had a problem early in our careers branding ourselves and finding our niche. So I'm just in the area that I'm still trying to find my niche so I can real, really like brand myself. I got you. This industry. Yeah, definitely. You're watching The Biggest Mix Show and we're here with Jeff Classic Beckham. Classic, it's classic. Classic, right? It's classic. Oh, uh, so Jeff, also when it comes, I think when you said you're, you're taking vocal lessons, you're, 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 you're actually making yourself better in every aspect that you can, I think that will transcend onto the stage as well in bodybuilding, correct? I, I, because it's an art form, correct? I, I think so too, and I, I appreciate it. I can identify with, with your, where you're coming from with, as far as um, putting another craft and, and bringing it to the stage and it, 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 it transpires through posing, absolutely. Absolutely, because I think you're one of the better posers out there it. in terms of bringing the art, slowing down, transition from move to move. It becomes an art form, you've got guys the special guest poser for today, it's Kai Green. Yes. One of those guys that takes it into an art form, makes a movie out of it, Which makes I'm people happy to say, please just say, I've been compared to Kai a lot with my there posing. So, so There you go. Watch out for me, guys. If you guys <laughs> haven't seen me posing, watch out. Absolutely, absolutely. But doing all these different things for the sport, I think people like you that make the posing a really good aspect of it, an important aspect. It's not just putting a couple of poses together there absolutely. and getting off stage, giving that presence, bringing that presentation to it. I think it's a very important thing. You're one of the guys that does that. Thank you. Thank you. Perfect, man. Also, we're here at Teaneck, uh, Teaneck uh, Marriott, which is a new venue. What do you guys think about the new venue? Honestly, okay. I would like to. Can I, can I talk first, Mr. Fabian? <laughs> okay. Mr. Sorry, MHP? Sorry. All right. So I would like to say this is just um, just so surreal and, and, and crazy me being here because this is where I actually turned pro in this venue here, where we are right now. I just remember like it was yesterday. I'm standing here taking pictures with people. It was just an amazing experience. So just coming back here it just makes me so nostalgic to turn turning pro. So I just love this venue. It's That's amazing. very good. Being the, at the Metropolitans, bringing all these amateurs to an atmosphere where you turn pro. All right, all right. Yep. There you go. Pro. There you go. And Fabian, <laughs> what do you think about the change in venue? I think it's the best thing that we could have done. You know, and as time grows, you know, and technology changes. You see a lot of people today, you know, more, uh, the software teams are more dependable yes. on how you look. Yes, absolutely. And as you can yes. see, you know, back in the 40s, people used to be all dressed up. Today, everybody wants to show off. So we live in a generation that everything is eye contact. Yes, so yes, yes. And, you know, and, and I would like to add to that by saying social, ma social media made it made it that way. Yes, you know? absolutely. With the constant you know influx of pictures that you see and the comparisons that we do with ourselves to others people all the time, social media definitely made that happen. And absolutely, it's definitely it one is of those, evolved. We those evolved. mediums yes. that we have, it, and people are actually taking advantage of it. Absolutely, because it is absolutely. free. Absolutely, okay, we're not paying for advertising. Back in the day, when you had to get a spot on the radio. 
video or a television spot, that costs a lot of money or an ad on a billboard. Yes. Now with your social media presence. You do it for free. You can do it for free. Spread your word. You know, those handles work. Yes. But we're going back in terms of being the technology, the bigger spaces, the better lighting. It's Absolutely. good for the yes. you know for the amateur athlete to come out here and get what these guys when they turn pro they get the stage. Now the amateurs at the first show, some of these people at the first show, they get this type of presentation. It's a good thing yeah. being on that stage, correct? Yes. Well, when I started computer in 1985 and 86 in wow. the 90s, Bring you know, we used us. to have like six competitors and maybe about 40 people, 50 people in the audience, you know, and there was no stages. It was, they were, everything was on the floor, you know what I mean? Yes. And then when they used to crown you with a, with a trophy, you used to go into these little steps, you know, back in like yes, the honor, like open iron, I, I you those know, things. and look where we are today. And back in the day, we used to have maybe 40 competitors in a, in, in a bodybuilding show, maybe 30, and today? Well, now we have hundreds. Yes. Hundreds four, and hundreds. 400 today. Yeah, hundreds and hundreds. 400 today. And a sold out crowd. As you can see behind me, we have, they, sold, they sold out. They sold out. Yeah, so I insane, can't wait for these insane, finals. Insane. When these finals kick off, we're going to really see what, they, what these competitors are bringing. I, I can see, you know, big shout out to um, Bev, to, to Steve, to, to Maz, and every, to Sean, to everybody who put this event together. Because as you notice, we changed venues and we're already outgrowing this place. This is so, so it's amazing. Absolutely. It's amazing. Thanks to them is that we're getting Definitely. the opportunity to present Absolutely. out here. And we appreciate that because Absolutely. we love this sport and we want to present it in the sure. best way possible. Sure. But sure. thanks a lot, guys. That's awesome. Well, I would like Please. to say something sure, before sure. I leave. I know, uh, first of all, you know, I just want to thank my brand, MHP. And Muscle Mass. I believe it's one of the best brands in the world. I'm not telling that all the brands are not, but I represent my brand. And I said it, the products are amazing. We have been very creative. Gerard has been very smart. We are, the whole team has been amazing and creating everything for you. And I want to just thank everyone. I want to thank you. I want to thank Steve, Bev, you know, Massali, Jim Mannion, you know, for uh, everything that we're doing. And we are actually the ones actually bringing this into the next generation and it's going to keep growing. So, People, my recommendation to you, don't stop dreaming and make all your dreams come true. Only you can do it. I did it, he did it, he did it. You can do it. Educate yourself. Amen. And remember something, you cannot reinvent the wheel. The wheel we invented, just decorate it. But be always cautious. Ask questions every time you get into something. Educate yourself. That's the key to success. Wow, man, you got me so motivated right now. This is what I want to hear. Thanks again for coming out to the Bigger the Big Show here at the MPC definitely, Metropolitan Championship in Teaneck, New absolutely, Jersey. Definitely. You guys are amazing. Thank Jeff, you so much. I look at big things from you in 2015. Thank you so much. Fabian, I'll Thank see you, much. brother. You are the man. I can't wait, Mr. Worldwide. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> Thank guys. Bro. We'll turn right back after these messages. Thank you, guys. Peace. Classic. Out.